All right, hi everyone. I'm just going to give you a quick guide on how to install and set up the content bot Chrome extension. So the first thing you, you're going to want to do is actually get to the Chrome extension uh, store page, uh, which is the link on our Facebook page or the link in the dashboard, or just contact us for the link or just search for it. Uh, you click on add to Chrome. This is going to have a little pop-up over here. You say, yes, it's going to know your email address and display notifications and read and change all data on the website that you visit. We don't actually do this. Uh, we only display notifications if your password that you enter is wrong and we only know your email address because we want to help you log in easier. Okay, so you click add extension. There we go, it's been added. You'll see it's actually added it over here. So what you need to do is you need to click on this little um, puzzle piece at the top here. And then what I would suggest is clicking on this pin over here, what that would do is actually add content bot straight to the bar over here. So it's a lot easier. You then click on that. You see, this is why we need to know your email address. So it'll ask you for your email address and then you can log in um, or you can connect the key. So if, if you've logged in with Google, for example, or Facebook for that matter, you're not going to be able to log in with this input form over here. What you can do though is connect your key. And to get your key, I'll show you quickly. You just go to the dashboard. You click on account and you click on profile. This will actually give you, this is your API key here. So if you just copy this and then paste it over here, it will log you in as well. Okay, but for this demo, I'm just going to log in. There we go, you're set, refresh your tab to get started. So you have to refresh your tab. If you want to write on the page that you currently installed it on, just refresh your tab. But this shows that uh, I've gone through quite a lot of credits this month. Um, I can unlink my account. I can go to my account on ContentBot's website. I can go to the documentation area. It also has nice settings um, for the layout and the theme. So you can play around with this and then your translation settings actually sit over here. So you don't have to set that each time. But now if I want to go to Google Docs, for example, I'm just gonna refresh this page. And what you'll see, just close Grammarly there, there's a little content bot icon over here. If you click that, then the panel loads. And with this panel comes all the power of content bot. So you can say, I love content marketing because and then what you want to do is let's just use tiny seed and do that and generate. There we go. So then it starts writing for you. Or what you can also do is then just delete that. Go to short form and you can go to like something like Cora answers. Why is content marketing so powerful? for businesses, generate. And there we have it. All right, all the best. I hope you enjoy the content bot Chrome extension while it's in beta. If there's any feedback or any issues at all, just please contact me using the live chat button on our website. Thank you.